Hello everybody, my name is Dance, and welcome back to the final station. Let's continue on from where we left off. So this guy, I think he's still bleeding. I still don't know how to actually solve that issue because we have no med kits. And he just he just seems like he's going to he's, he's going to die. I, I don't know. I gave him a med kit. It didn't seem like it did anything at all. So he's probably just dead. So sorry, Bob. That's just the way the cookie crumbles. Okay, so let's get the uh, engine to all be powered back to regular. We'll drop this down. There we go. Everything's back with the regular power. Yeah, no, he's dead. I, I don't... Do you need a doctor? He says we need a doctor. So maybe you need a specific person to do it? I'm not too sure. How far are we to actually getting to the next station? We're about halfway. Caught code in terms of a matter. A lot of things are offline. Machinist operators. And we're using 92 out of 100 of our battery. Is there anything in here that we can kind of deal with? I, I don't know how this crate is taking up 20 power, but it, it just is. I mean, it might, it might have, I don't think it was 20. It might have been like 15. No, it, it, this, this little thing is taking up 20 power. Still not 100% too sure how, but... Just make sure everything is working as intended. You guys are hungry. Okay. So we'll get these guys some food. There he goes. He's full. It's the... The white space is how much, you know, hunger that they have used, so... She's got a little bit of food, but we might as well feed her. I don't think we ever need to eat food, which is convenient. There you go, you can have some food. This is already using up some more power. I don't know what happens. Like, I don't really know what we need the power for. I'm assuming there's probably gonna be upgrades for the train at some point, but... As of right now... Okay, well, we've arrived at the station. So let's, let's stop here. How many bulls did we have? I do not even remember. I'm assuming it's probably like half of a clip. Oh no, it's one full clip. Wow, you're... You're doing wonderfully, aren't we? Okay, we have full HP. Absolutely no med kits. We have one food, no keys, and that's fine. We have a dead woman here. Two bullets. Oh, what's this? Looks like I forgot the blocker's code at home. Okay, well, we have to go find the code. And I think with these guys, I think we just need to start punching them. And just kind of spam the button. I, I, it sucks that you're probably going to hear a lot of mouse clicking in the actual microphone. What is this? Don't forget it. Okay. Well, the code's somewhere. We have to go find it. Except for these guys. These guys need to die. There we go. Okay. Spam this button as much as possible. We just we just can't be using bullets. I, I was way, I've been way too liberal with my bullet usage. We need to kind of cut down on that. Uh, we can use a chair. Forgot. Uh, can we c carry it up with us? We can't. Accidentally shot a bullet because I was spamming the, uh, the button too much. Well, they're just kind of up here. Well, luckily, we can kind of cheese the system by just standing underneath them and they can't do anything about it. Didn't really need to use a bullet there, but that's fine. We actually have 12 bullets. Where did we get 12 from? Or is that one thing that said it gave two bullets? Did it actually give 12? I wasn't actually... Maybe it did. Spoon, $8. Still don't know what money actually does. We got some food. Well, it doesn't look like there's anything down here, so we should be fine. We'll see if there's any monsters up here. If there are... A smoke monster. Well, we'll just kind of hide out down here and hope that he can't actually hit us. Yeah, no, we can't really do anything. But we can't actually punch. Why can't we not punch? We were able to punch here. Or is because it's a different ladder, I guess? Well, now I can't really do anything because he's just going to kind of stand there. Oh, he catches on fire, and that almost killed me. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. So they're combustible. That is great. I can't really see what's down here. Looks like it's nothing. Can we even... Can we shoot them, you think? No, how am I supposed to... Like, what do I do? Like, how am I supposed to kill these guys? It doesn't look like there's actually an easy way to do it. And we can't actually shoot down past this thing. That's great. Is there another way where we can go? Is there a map? No. We can't really do anything. Okay, well, reload because we might as well. But I think we're dead. Like, I can't think of a way we can get past this. Yeah, no, we just die. Okay. So is there a correct way to do that? I don't... Well, we, have, we got full HP back, so that's nice. But is there a way to actually get through here? 
It looks like there's a door. Let's see if we can maybe find another way around. I feel like that that can't be the right way. And there should be an easier way to do it. Ah, uh, there's a door. See it? Okay. Fantastic. I knew there had to be another way. Oh, it's locked. Okay, well, never mind then. Is there any keys around? Or is that just like the door to get out once we already have finished it? Well, that's a little bit annoying, but that's fine. I guess we just have to go down there and just shoot them a bunch. It seems like the wrong thing to do, but as far as I can tell, it's really the only thing we can do. So we just go down here. Well, we killed them all. Fantastic. Uh, let's open this door. Okay, we'll kill that guy. Reload again. We already have, like, no bullets. Oh, there we go. We got eight more. Fantastic. Oh, what's out here? What is this? What the hell is this? Is that like a bomb? Looks like it's just a giant like capsule. So this is where the code is. We know the code's this way. We can just kill this guy easily. No problem. Just four hits. If there's a way I can get a stronger melee attack, I would absolutely love it. Money's $20. Ah, this looks like a bigger level than I think the other ones have been. Over here, we can just kind of cheese it, which is always nice. Because they can't hit us, we can hit them. Uh, got some more pills, some rags. We can throw a toilet at somebody. Well, never mind. Okay. I don't know, Jane. Uh, he is becoming more distant from me. Are we cheating on you? Okay, well, Michelle's, like, been eaten, I'm assuming. Well, it doesn't look like there's anything down here. There is a punchable wall. Got another crate. But the dead person, I'm assuming this has the code. 5661. Got another punchable wall over here. I'm assuming there's a monster on the other side. Oh no, there's just another dead person. With six bullets, okay. Well, we've gotten a lot of bullets out of this mission, which is lovely. Oh, was there something else back here, or was that just a note? Yeah, no, it's just a note. Well, we'll, we'll kind of continue this way and see if maybe there's something else, unless it just kind of stops me. Okay, yeah, we can't go anywhere that way. Well, that's fine. Oh, we actually can't we can't climb back up this uh, garbage can? Well, that's fine. I guess it's more of a dumpster than a garbage can. But, uh... I guess we'll go down here. Don't know why. You think just going back up the garbage can would make a lot more sense. Well... I'll throw that box at one. I don't know why it, throwable objects just kill everybody in one shot. Really, no matter what the object actually is. Whether or not it's a giant, like a chair or a cardboard box. Okay, we have two guys down there. Oh, we have like a huge army down there. Well, that doesn't sound very good, does it? Do we have bullets? We have a med kit. Oh, med kits are always nice. But it almost seems like if we die and we just get full HP, then why ever use the med kit to heal ourselves? Like, I, that doesn't, it doesn't seem like that would ever be useful, but maybe just because this is, I think it's still a beta, so maybe that's why. We have, uh, three cardboard boxes here. Well, we could, can we just walk off the edge? Oh, we, we can't. We're just kind of stuck here now. So I should not have shot the gun. Lesson learned, do not... Oh, can we do it the other way as well? We can take a few pot shots. They're just staring at me. It's kind of creepy. Kill this guy. Oh, we didn't even kill him. Knock off that guy's helmet. Okay, we have one more clip. So all the bullets we did get this mission, we've already lost them all. Kind of come down here and punch them. The, the only good thing about these guys is they do have like a delayed attack, and you can actually kind of see when they're planning on attacking. Okay, he his attack animation was done by that point. Don't even give it to me, the game. Okay. Well, we have no more bullets. We have one crate. We can throw that at somebody. I'm assuming we're probably going to die the next time we open a door. Okay, we have three bullets. Wonderful. We have another med kit. I'd rather just die, I think, and get all the bullets back from the last save than just use a med kit factory key 
Can't believe I wasted a bullet there. Actually, I'm, I, I can believe that because that's just kind of the person that I would be and just completely whiff. Okay, well, those are just the things telling us how to get the code. 5661. Six, we have one med kit. We, didn't get, we got some food as well, so that's always nice. But other than that, it doesn't feel like we've really gotten anything, does it? I mean, we got two, yeah, we got two med kits. We have a key. Unless the key is only level specific and then it doesn't carry over, which would, which I'm pretty sure is how it works, which is disappointing. So are you guys. You guys are good on food. You kind of kind of use a little bit more health. And like I said, I'm probably never going to use the med kits. Because it doesn't really seem like it's beneficial. There you go. You can have full HP. Get this down. Have everything be level. Let's go back here. Make sure that this is all powered correctly. And how much further until the next... Okay, we're almost there. And that is fine. We're going 114 kilometers an hour. And where's the final destination? I'm, I'm assuming... Well, there's three. We can either go here, here... Or there. Well, that, that's, that's assuming that this is actually lets us choose which direction we go in. But, I mean, we got heater and it didn't let us choose, so... I'm assuming we're just gonna go straight. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six more stops. Which would make sense. Because we, we didn't start here. And I think the first part is about an hour long. We've already gotten about 30 minutes in. Uh, to, to information provided by sponsors. Always built here. Connects to all four parts of the city. Four languages. Well, maybe we can choose. Oh, oh, you guys are dying. Sorry about that. Two days and that's all. Well, you guys, you didn't die that much, so that's fine. They're not really... Or are they hungry? No, they are hungry. Okay, well, we got food for you. I got some important information going on over here. What is this? Oh, Tim Barlow. Are you still in Brightstone? Tim? Well, are we still in Brightstone? No. Where the hell is Brightstone? Okay, no, we're, we're, we're way past Brightstone. But, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll kind of go on to the next level. I don't think they lose hunger or health when we're doing the mission parts, so hopefully they'll be fine. But it's a little bit hard to say. We have three bullets. Basically nothing. Hello? Is the cargo safe? What cargo? Upstairs in your office. Ooh, new guns. Well, he's wearing the same hat as I am, so I'm assuming we're on the same team. Don't go to the subway. Well, okay, we can we can do that. Ooh, a shotgun. We got 12 bullets. Only four shotgun shells, though, so... But a shotgun, that's, that's definitely going to help us out. Absolutely. It said don't go to the subway, so how about we just pass over the subway for now? I'm assuming they're, like, bombs or something. Like, here's another one of the capsules. They gotta be bombs. Like, I can't think of what else. Okay, this locks. We have to go to the subway. Okay, what's over here? We got a toilet. Wires and rigs. We got some money. I still don't know what money does. We can't... Is there like a jump button that I'm just missing? Like, it seems weird that I can just punch the window and not do anything with it. Yeah, no. There's just there's nothing there. Okay. Uh, hi guys. How are how are all of you? Yeah, okay. Well, I can I can understand the whole let's not go to the subway thing. But other than that, it doesn't really look like we can go anywhere. Can we shoot the lock? I actually never even thought about that. No, the answer is we cannot shoot the lock. So I'm assuming we have to use the shotgun here. 
because there's really no other way that we can possibly ever think about doing this. The shotgun sounds kind of badass. That's a really good shotgun sound. Now we just lured them all towards us. This hasn't helped our cause at all. Okay. Well, we'll get the shotgun. Take one shot. Well, we've already out of, we're already out of shotgun shells. So... We could try to run away. That did not work. I don't know why I thought that would work. But we gotta play it at least a little bit smart. I think my problem is that I always just shoot on the railing and drag everybody towards me. And I probably should not do that. Yeah, that still goes nowhere. We can't get these crates, which or these the lockers, which is annoying. Get the wires and the rags. Uh, just, just make sure we think. Let's do a double check of the main building. Yeah, no, there's absolutely nothing. Nothing we could have left there. I really don't like these guys. It's also a double barrel. If it was like a, if there was a handful more barrels you would be a little bit more useful. Okay, we've actually killed quite a lot of them. If we can just keep getting headshots, and if I could aim, like, directly below me, that would have been great as well, but... Let's take, take a few pot shots. Yeah, that actually worked out pretty okay, all things considered. Don't bite me. Do not bite me. There we go. I'm kind of- actually, that wasn't as hard as I thought it would be. So it looks like they kind of just massacred the entirety of the subway station. But is there anything we can loot? Is there any way I can get up to the lockers? Jones, if it's true and you hold information about person who came from across the border, the first contact. Um... At 4.15, you know who- well, I mean that- there is no clock. I can't see what time it is. And I'm assuming that's an old letter, so... We have no more shotgun shells. We have seven bullets. So we have to go into the city. Is there any, like... Oh! Hello! I... Mo, you guys can have fun down there. I'll be this way. No power. He still does a lot of damage, even though I was nowhere near him. Okay, well let's- okay. So now that we know there's an exploding guy in there, we can, we can kind of deal with the situation a little bit better than we did before. So... Don't go this way. It'll, it'll just open up a- okay, so there's the battery you want. But don't go this way. We're gonna do... Two quick bullets. We're gonna open this up. We're gonna reload, actually. Just make sure we have all the bullets we can. And then just punch this guy probably twice. Yeah, there we go. Okay, we have two bullets. We'll get the power supply. Plug it in here. Plug it. No, I. Can I not? Can I not get this now? Can I not get the battery? Have I screwed this entire- No, I get- I can't believe I wasted- I wasted a bullet on that. Because the game kind of screwed me over there. Can't see what's in that window. I'm so dead. I can't- I cannot deal with these guys at all. Like, I'm not too sure the correct way to do that. Oh, we have to go back here and deal with the power supply issue again? Okay, well, we don't, there's no, no reason to even go this way. But at least we know what to do. Let's not waste a bullet this time. Go over here. Make them open the door. One, two, three. Punch, punch, punch. Reload. Let's get this battery again. Let's not go through the door with the two jumping guys, because I just can't. I can't deal with their shenanigans. We'll, we'll just go up this time. And hopefully there's nothing bad. Okay, yeah, there's nothing here. Wonderful. It's T12. Okay. That's fine. 
staff only. I'm gonna go with those monsters in there, so let's go up. Well, there's monsters in there as well, but at least here we can kind of cheese it. Let's punch them, punch them. We gotta punch the helmet off this guy. Is there a way I can... Can I not punch the helmet if I'm below him? I mean, that kind of makes sense, but... Can I just punch you to death? Or was it... I think we tried punching one of these guys to death before and just took like 500 shots. $24. A lot of stuff this way. Another one of these shells. Yeah, so I think it's like some sort of chemical weapon attack. Parking lot. There's just so many. There's like too many zombies. I'm not even... How do you deal with all these zombies? That's absolutely the no-go zone. So we're not going to go that way. I don't even know why I opened the door. If anything, that's just going to screw us over later. Oh, the door is locked. Oh, wonderful. Absolutely perfect. Okay. So what the, like, what the hell do I do? It seems like there are too many zombies to do anything about. We can kind of do this here. Like, are you meant to kind of cheese it like it? Like this? And just kind of like break the rules of the game? Because it kind of feels like it. Because I can't really see a way to do it with the amount of bullets that the game gives you. There we go. Well, we killed them. We have a... Cr we got six bullets. I can't, no, I actually just kind of wanted the crate so I could throw it at somebody, but I guess six bullets is fine as well. And this is actually... It is the ladder, so we can actually punch people. Okay, well, we took the helmets off some of them. Somehow that didn't... How are these bullets not hitting anybody? That doesn't even... We'll kill that one. I wish we could just walk off the side of the ladder. That would make things a lot simpler. This is probably the dumbest way to do this. Well, we killed some of them. Everybody other than the, the armored guys are dead. So yeah, you just walk off. Walk somewhere in this direction so I can actually shoot you. Thank you. Please go please go that way, because I can't can't hit you otherwise. I don't like the sounds that's coming from this direction, and I kinda of feel like I'm gonna be killed if I kinda of walk this way. Oh no, it's probably from this thing. Wires, wood. I don't know why we would need wood, but that's fine. Nothing really this way. I guess there's somewhere up there. I don't know why this pixel is a different color, but... Okay, so like we got a computer that's kind of going up there. I probably should just stop. One of these doors has a zombie in it. Which one is it? Is it the third one? Yeah, there we go. Probably should not have even opened the door. It actually is kind of screwing me over by opening the door. Do we have bullets? Oh, 12. Oh, we actually have some shotgun shells as well. Fantastic. We're going to need those shotgun shells. Well, we can at least kind of cheese. And you know what? I'm actually going... Even though I said there's no reason to ever use a medkit, I'm actually going to use one here. Just to make sure that when I die, if I die, I don't start all the way back and trying to get the battery. Because I know that's at least where the last save was. Come back here. Come back towards the slayers. Let me punch you all to death. This really shouldn't be working. But it is. So we're going to kind of keep doing it. There we go. Okay. So we have some boxes here. I mean, I'm assuming you're supposed to be using these boxes to kill the zombies, but... Okay, so you can kind of stealth kill them, kind of. I mean, it, it, it kind of works. I'm assuming the guy's like right here. Get some more money, we'll grab another TV, just in case we need to throw it at somebody. 
Well, there doesn't seem to be anybody up here unless the guy in here turned into a zombie. Handcuffs, eight dollars. Well, why did I come in here? There, there, there's nothing here. Unless I am missing something. It seems like this entire area was just a waste of time. And I still don't have the, the train key. Okay, well, it looks like we have to kind of... Oh, is this wall breakable? Oh, there's actually just not a wall there. Okay, well... That's fine. Can we shoot past this thing? I'm not too sure, but we can at least punch the helmet off this guy. Shoot him in the face. This guy, we don't need to shoot him, so we can just punch him four times. One, two, three, four... That's where we came from. Can we open the door from this side at least? It's locked from both sides. That's not how doors work, but that's fine. Okay, so we did damage to both of these guys. So they're going to go down in two hits. Oh, this guy's going to go down in the full four. Okay, well, whatever. Uh, do these guys have anything? No. We can play some music. Isn't that nice? Is this locked? It is. Okay, so we have to go up and up and around. Cafe LTD, which I don't really know what that stands for, but... Let's kind of spam the buttons. You got anything in here, at least? For $14. Once again, still don't know what the dollars do. I got a bookstore. Nothing in here. Oh, one book. Well, I don't know why I care about that book at all. So let's at least try to find the key code that we need. We still haven't found it. Really hate, I really hate the small ones. You have anything in here? No. So where is this guy? Nope, okay, don't care about that stuff. Got some flavor text, but it's not really super important. Yeah, I'm assuming he's just gonna be in the exact. What we could do is we could shoot a bullet through here. Oh, you can see, just punch the glass. Okay. These are really, really small apartment buildings. Is there a zombie down here? No. Once again, there's there's nothing here. I'm assuming it's just it's just flavor, and I don't really care about flavor right now. Kind of just want to find the guy with the key code. I hate that. How are you supposed to? I mean, I guess you could shoot across, but you'd have to know he was there in order to shoot across. So okay, well, let's go with the shotgun. Don't like this. Don't like this. There we go. Okay. Well, do you have bullets in here? You do. Uh, I still don't know where the last checkpoint is. I really, really like the shotgun, though. Okay. We got two more shells, more medkits. What are you? Oh, we found actual people. I'm surprised they didn't just shoot me as soon as I opened the door. Stay where you are. Are you from the train? Yes. We have two, three. No, I have some ammo. Just worry about yourself. Well, I was going to. I was definitely not going to give you my ammo. Don't be ridiculous. I cannot take the others. Good lord. Okay, so we got one guy on the train. Train. So we got two of the people. The other two, they're just going to stay. I don't know where, what they're going to do. They're just going to stand in there, I guess. Is this the key code? Fi finally. If we just, ha if that door would just open. Or, you know, we climb the fence. Then we wouldn't have to go through the train station. The subway station. Which one of these letters told us explicitly never to do. So... We're gonna get full HP soon. We have four food. Hopefully that's enough, but... 
Actually, is it possible just to guess the key combination? Like, if I knew it was 6, 7, 3, 1 before, what would happen? Would the train just leave? I mean, I, I guess so, but I'm not too sure. But what I am sure of is that this is going to be a good time to end this video. So thanks everybody for watching. If you would like to see more of this game, please uh, thumbs up. Remember to subscribe. And if you did enjoy it, I guess you can always thumb down, leave a bad comment down below. And goodbye.